So first of all, you need to do just restart your PC. Just go down here and select boot from Windows 10 and then press enter. Now be patient for a while, do not do anything. Alright, now swipe the lock screen, do not log into the account. Just click on power button, then press and hold down the shift button and the click on restart. Now be patient for a while. Alright, click on troubleshoot option, then choose advanced option, next click on command prompt. Then your PC will reboot, now be patient for a while. Go down and select boot from windows 10 and then press enter. Then it will take you to common prompt. Then you have to select the user. I will recommend you that login as admin. Then type the password. Alright, now you have to reveal the BCD, I mean the boot configuration data. Just follow the instruction exactly. Just type the comment bootrec space forward slash fix mbr then press enter. Next type the comment bootrec space forward slash fix boot then press enter. Next type the comment bootrec space forward slash scanos then press enter. Well, next type the comment bootrec space forward slash reviewed bct then press enter. Yeah, done. And type the final comment exit then press enter. And just turn off your PC, just patient for a while, then turn the PC back on. Yes, now you can see the fixed boot from the Windows bootloader instead of grab bootloader.
make sure that login as admin. Well, then right click on start menu, go to the disk management, now you have to delete the Ubuntu partition from here, just right click on this partition and select delete option, then click on yes. Then Right click on where you created the partition for Ubuntu and select extend volume option. Then click on next and click on finish. Well, now let's check boot from windows bootloader is properly fixed or not. Yeah, it's working properly. comment and share we need your support and guys don't forget to subscribe our channel thank you thanks for watching